Welcome to Home TV. I'm Patrick Mazuka, and here's what's happening at Northwestern Ontario today. Ontario youths aged 12 to 17 will be able to receive their booster doses of the COVID-19 vaccine at the end of this week. It was announced yesterday by the Ontario government that third dose eligibility will be expanded for those aged 12 to 17 on Friday, February 18th. Appointments can be booked through the provincial booking system on Ontario.ca and the provincial vaccine contact center. Youths can also receive their boosters at select pharmacies that offer the Pfizer vaccine. Appointments will be booked for approximately six months after their second dose. A drug bust in Sandy Lake First Nation has led to two residents facing charges. Late last January, police conducted a search of a home where they found cocaine, two firearms and over $11,000 in cash. As a result, the two residents have been charged with possession of the purpose of trafficking cocaine and possession of property obtained by crime over $5,000. In addition, one of the residents was also charged with two counts of unauthorized possession of firearms. Both of the accused have been released from custody to appear in the court at a later date. A British Columbia man is facing multiple charges after a vehicle and on foot pursuit by police in Dryden. On February 7th, Dryden OPP attempted to conduct a traffic stop on Highway 17 west of Ignace at around 11 a.m. The vehicle initially pulled over and stopped for police before accelerating and fleeing the scene heading westbound. The vehicle was later found abandoned on Bedworth Avenue in Dryden. The driver had reportedly fled on foot and was later found and placed under arrest at around 12.30 p.m. 46-year-old Andrew Gillis of Vancouver, British Columbia is facing multiple charges including dangerous operation, flight from a peace officer, and operation while prohibited. And that's your Home TV News Update for this hour. I'm Patrick Mazuka, and have a great day.